What's up guys? Chris here oh, from Rawa Beach in Changu, Bali. Sorry, it's been, uh, what, like 10 months now since my last video. I'm back in Las Palmas de Gran Canaria. Um, yeah, haven't been focused a lot on fitness in the last uh, 10 months, I guess. Been kind of in and out. Uh, I did some more of Alexia Clark in Playa del Carmen, Mexico, but today I'm at Brawa Beach, as I said, in Changu, Bali. And I thought it'd be a good time to jump back on Nomad Fit because I found a pretty good Nomad Fit workout right here on the beach. Um, there's this uh, little uh, outdoor gym. If you just come out uh, from where Finns is, turn right, and then walk down the beach a little bit to a place called I'll put the name on your screen, I can't remember what it's called. But right next to it is this cool outdoor gym, it's behind me. Um, so they got pull up bars, they got a few barbells with uh, concrete for plates, um, just concrete like balls on the end. Uh, and they've got a place where you can do dips. Um, yeah, it's quite versatile. I mean, you can't change the plates on any of the equipment, but what I've been doing, um, kind of my routine uh, now in Bali that I've developed is uh, I'm doing these uh, two-day split so on the first day I'm doing pull-ups then I'm doing push-ups on the tire uh, and then I do some barbell curls and what I do after that is I run to the beach and back I do that five times and trust me even though the weight is not that heavy you get pretty tired pretty quickly um, because I'm doing no rest between those sets. Um, so do the six to 10 pull-ups, then go straight into the uh, tire push-ups, then straight into the barbell curls, run to the beach and back, and then have about a minute's rest, a minute and a half maybe towards the end when I get really tired. Um, and then today is my second split. I've been doing uh, tricep dips with the bars over there. Um, then I've been doing uh, almost like a, yeah, pretty much a row. Um, and then I've been doing the shoulder press with the barbell. And I mean, the, the dips are pretty tough for me still, and the pull-ups are pretty tough. The other ones are a bit lighter, but yeah, like I said, it's all about that density. So packing that together, you get a really good workout. So yeah, I just wanted to share this workout with you guys. Um, if you're in the Changu area, um, I was gonna call this video free workout in Changu because I thought this gym was free but as I was working out here today I saw a sign that says uh, drop in rate 20k which is about two Australian dollars a dollar 40 US so definitely affordable uh, but I thought it was completely free so I feel a bit, a bit, bit of a dick now I'll have to bring some money next time next time I come to this beach but yeah a dollar 40 US pretty cheap and you can get a monthly for I think 200k so that's uh, 14 dollars US I think so yeah um, coming to Changu definitely check this spot out there are a few other gyms I I checked out one was called uh, Victory Fitness actually cost the same as this gym but uh, it was pretty much unusable and crowded I mean they had barbells and plates but not that many plates and not that many barbells so it felt like everyone was competing over the gear um, I tried uh, CrossFit as well at Wanderlust CrossFit and I did my back within half an hour and I mean the price that you can use this gym for a month is the same rate as the drop-in for CrossFit Wonderlust. So if you just want to go to CrossFit Wonderlust for a day, it's going to cost you 14 US or you can come work out here for about 14 US so for a month. So it's up to you. Um, there's plenty of fitness options in Changu. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Um, I've been here just over six weeks now so or almost six weeks so uh, yeah got a little bit of experience in the area hopefully I can create more of these nomad fit videos for you in future yeah thanks for watching I hope to see you soon and sorry it's taken me so long to make another video I'll catch you guys on the next one